Guys, there's that that guy right here. Nobody speaks to him. Scrooge, you must be a very nice character, judging by your name. Let's see. Oh, Adam Smith, name doesn't even rhyme with money. How could he possibly know anything about economics? He continues, sophisticated economics talk. Um, <laughs> well, I mean, I would like to leave. Excuse me, who are you? Oh, I am Scrooge. Yes, <laughs> Scrooge Brunny, co-owner of Brunny's and Leak's Roaring Rubber Plant. Also the inventor of the trickle-down effect and honorable member of the Royal Society for the Prevention of Minimum Wages. I deem it highly important that the market, and he continues his sophisticated economics talk. He will probably never shut up. We, we have to interrupt him. Like, I deem it highly important th that the market... Hey! <laughs> Dude, come on! Talk to me! I'm right in front of you. Recognize the hidden opportunities and the vulnerability, vulnerability of certain demographic groups. Uh, yes, yes. Well... <laughs> what are we going to do? Are we going to... For the quick money or are we going to earn it? You know what? People that are going for the quick money often are like him. And even... If he is very successful um, financially, let's earn it. It's probably getting us much less money, but let's do that. Did you talk to Paul? He always has something to do. Yeah, I will try that. <laughs> I have been directed in his way for the second time, but I don't know where Paul is. Are you Paul? You are Paul. Hello, Paul. Hey, I'm Paul. <laughs> yeah, I just saw that. Um, hello, Paul. You look like you're new here. Um, like, what makes you think that I'm new? The way you move around, checking everything out. You, you don't seem to be familiar with this environment. No offense, of course. I hope you have a great start. And there's an end. <laughs> Additional um, just take all the typos and keep them for yourselves. <laughs> um, yeah, but I'm all right, but I don't really trust you. Like I could, I could. You know what? You should always have the strength to ask for help. Uh, I guess so. It's it's hard to be new. Been there, trust me. And asking for help is a strength that is often underestimated. Good to see you are not lying to yourself. So what's the matter? Well, I don't really know where to start. I I don't have any home. I don't have any money. I have been fleeing something that I don't really know. This goes on. I might be able to help you out there. Hey, let's work something out. I have a lot of contacts and can easily get you a place to crash by and a bit of food in the tummy. I mean, <laughs> that would be great. Um, is there anything you want in return? Or are you just that kind? As a matter of fact, I might need a little assistance as well and... and... <laughs> sorry. As a matter of fact, I might need a little assistance as well, and an unfamiliar face comes in quite handy. Listen, I lost track to my assistant, Kate Cassie. No clue, clue where she is, but I need her to be available right now. Remedy. I don't care what she is doing, just find her and make sure she'll get back immediately. You sound a little bit impatient. Is she going to be alright? Things will be dealt with internally, don't worry, she will not lose her job, but this must not happen again. I mean, <laughs> losing a job is not always the worst option. 
I don't know her, I'm not going to snitch on her. And maybe she will feel even freer and better um, than she is now. More liberated, that's the word I was looking for. I see. No apartment then. Um, no, not from you, dude. Not from you. If you wish, go now. Okay. One more thing. Hey, I'm Paul. Yeah, I know you, idiot. Um, why is this not working? <laughs> we found a bug. How nice that is. What I did here is I... Yes, thank you. I hit the P key. Um, as I am the developer of the game, I don't want to hide anything from you. There are bugs in it. Some of them are going to be fixed. Others I currently don't know how to fix. Um, so that's why I put the option to, to press on P. And that is how you basically reload the level. Um, in, if you are in the spaceport or in the city later. So that you you cannot get stuck anywhere. You you always have that way out. Um, I think I talked to everybody up here. Um, I, c I could leave now, but I, I want to see everything. Or should we leave? Who are you? Makazoli. 126, 127, 128. Eight. What is he counting? <laughs> he seems packed. Anyways, okay. Not much help from him. There is somebody. Oh, there's a toilet. <laughs> I don't know if anything of interest might be here. Let's just take a look. Maybe here, the dispensers. Maybe here. Or maybe here. We found Cassie, as we can see. And I am not going to bother her there. Like, you could talk to her, but I'm not going to. She is probably taking a dump or something. Um, you don't want to be talked to when you're taking a dump. Um, who are you? Are you Crutch or are you Sam? You are Sam. Hello, Sam. <laughs> Good boy. No, you are Crutch. Um, the almighty blister revealed to me that a strong warrior would come across my way. And for the blister exists, so must the warrior. Welcome. <laughs> I'm getting blisters listening to you, buddy. <laughs> what are you talking about? So, are you a shaman or a drug addict? Oh. The mighty warrior beats his gracious fellow. I want to know the truth. Call me as you desire, warrior of blisters. Crutch would do, though. Now close your eyes, darling. What do you see? What? Why? I see blackness and light. And it feels good. What are you talking about, dude? <laughs> Come on! <laughs> We're down here. <sighs> Should we warn Cassie about Paul? But... <laughs> You know, she is taking a dump. I'm not gonna contact her. That's none of our business. And you, maybe in your own game, <laughs> can talk to the lady who is just taking a dump. And it will say a lot about you personally. I am going to leave the spaceport. Let's get into adventure.